Signal has become the de facto king of secure messaging apps of late, stealing users from WhatsApp and gathering millions of others looking for private forms of communication. That means the police and governments will be wanting, more than ever, to ensure they have forensic techniques to access Signal messages. Court documents obtained by Forbes not only attest to that desire, but indicate the FBI has a way of accessing Signal texts even if they're behind the lock screen of an iPhone. The clues came via Seamus Hughes at the Program on Extremism at the George Washington University in court documents containing screenshots of Signal messages between men accused, in 2020, of running a gun trafficking operation in New York. The suspects have not yet entered a plea and remain innocent until proven guilty, in the signal chats obtained from one of their phones, they discuss not just weapons trades but attempted murder too, according to documents filed by the Justice Department. There's also some metadata in the screenshots, which indicates not only that signal had been decrypted on the phone, but that the extraction was done in, partial AFU. That latter acronym stands for, after first unlock, and describes an iPhone in a certain state, an iPhone that is locked but that has been unlocked once and not turned off. An iPhone in this state is more susceptible to having data inside extracted because encryption keys are stored in memory. Any hackers or hacking devices with the right iPhone vulnerabilities could then piece together keys and start unlocking private data inside the device. For police to access private signal messages from an iPhone, there are some other caveats besides a device needing to be in AFU mode. The iPhone in question appears to be either an iPhone 11, whether Pro or Max, or a second-generation iPhone SE. It's unclear if the police can access private data on an iPhone 12. It's also not clear what software version was on the device. Newer iOS models may have better security. Apple declined to comment, but pointed Forbes to its response to previous research regarding searches of iPhones in AFU mode in which it noted they required physical access and were costly to do. A Signal spokesperson said, if someone is in physical possession of a device and can exploit an unpatched Apple or Google operating system vulnerability in order to partially or fully bypass the lock screen on Android or iOS, they can then interact with the device as though they are its owner. Keeping devices up to date and choosing a strong lock screen passcode can help protect information if a device is lost or stolen. Counsel for the defendant in the New York case didn't respond to messages. The Justice Department said it couldn't comment. Forensic exploitation of devices affects any encrypted communications app, from WhatsApp to Wicker, not just Signal.